Hi children, in the last exercise we did division is reverse multiplication and now we are going to do division is division using multiplication tables. Once you are thorough with that, very easy. Okay, so we are going to find out the division, you have to say your tables and find the answer from there. Look. Let's look at our first exercise. See what is given to you. So we are going to find out. We are going to work out the table. Through table, we are going to do the division. 16 divided by 2. What is the answer? Okay. So we have already done reverse multiplication. Now let's use the tables. Here we have to use what table? 2 times table. Okay. And say aloud and write it down till you get the answer 16. Okay, now that is how when it comes to 16 you stop, then you get the correct answer here. 16 divided by 2. So, 2 ones are 2. Okay, say aloud and write it down. 2 ones are 2. 2 twos are 4. Two ones are two, two twos are four. Two fours are eight, six. Two threes are six. Our answer is sixteen. Two threes are six. Two fours are eight. We have to go on because we have to come up to sixteen. Next, two fives are ten. Next. Two sixes are twelve. Two sevens are fourteen. Two eights are sixteen. What is the number we have? Sixteen. So the two times table we have to thorough it. We should know the table. Two eights are sixteen. So we have sixteen here. We have to divide 16 by 2 and your answer will be 8. In the last exercise we did reverse multiplication. 8 twos are 16. Yeah? 2 eights are 16. You see that? Division is reverse multiplication which we did in the last exercise. So to find the 16 divided by 2, all you need to do go through the tables. Two ones are two, two twos are four, two threes are six, two fours are eight, two fives are ten, two sixes are twelve, two sevens are fourteen, two eights are sixteen, and your answer is eight. Two eights are sixteen. Reverse eight twos are sixteen. Now you see how you found your answer? Good. Did you enjoy the exercise? Let's take another sum. Look. 35 divided by 5. 35. So the 5 times table we must know. Let's write down the 5 times table. 5 ones are 5. 5 twos are 10. 5 threes are 15. 5 fours are 20. 5 fives are 25. 5 sixes are 30. 5 sevens are 35. 35, yes, we have 35 here. 5 sevens are 35. So 35 divided by 5 gives you what answer? 7. Division is reverse multiplication. 5 sevens are 35. 7 fives are 35. 5 sevens are 35. 7 fives are 35. So you know how to get the answer? Say this again. 5 ones are 5. 5 twos are 10. 5 threes are 15. 5 fours are 20. 5 fives are 25. 5 sixes are 30. 5 sevens are 35. 35 divided into 5 groups and you get in each group 7. Yes, did you enjoy finding 
the answer using the tables. Let's look at another sum. Look, 63 divide equally into 7 groups. And let's see what answer we'll get. So we must know here 7 times table. Yes, look. 7 ones are 7. 7 twos are 14. 7 threes are 21. 7 fours are 28. 7 fives are 35. 7 sixes are 42. 7 sevens are 49. 7 eights are 56. 7 nines are 63. Yes, we have 63 to be divided equally into 7 boxes. And let's see how many we get. What is your answer? 63 divided by 7 gives you the answer 9. Now in reverse multiplication you get 9 into 7, 63. 7 into 9, 63. Good. So we learned to find the answer using multiplication tables. Let's look at another sum. 27. 27 to be grouped equally into 3. And let's see what's the answer. Here we need to know the 3 times table. Good. Here we go. 3 ones are 3. 3 twos are 6. 3 threes are 9. 3 fours are 12. 3 fives are 15. 3 sixes are 18. 3 sevens are 21. 3 eights are 24. 3 nines are 27. And here we are, we have 27. 3 ones are 3. 3 twos are 6. 3 threes are 9. 3 fours are 12. 3 fives are 15. 3 sixes are 18. 3 sevens are 21. 3 eights are 24. 3 nines are 27. We are grouping 27 into three equal groups and how many we'll get in each group? Nine. Twenty-seven divided by three. What is your answer? Nine. In reverse multiplication you get nine threes are twenty-seven. Three nines are twenty-seven. Good. Did you enjoy finding the answer using multiplication? Let's take another sum. Let's look at this sum. 80 to be divided equally into 8 groups. Okay? So we need to know 8 times table. We are going to divide 80 into 3 8 equal groups. So let's write down the 8 times table. Yes? Good. 8 8 ones are 8 8 twos are 16. 8 threes are 24. 8 fours are 32. 8 fives are 40. 8 sixes are 48. 8 sevens are 56. 8 eights are 64. 8 nines are 72, 8 tens are 80. That is 8 times table. 8 ones are 8, 8 twos are 16, 8 threes are 24, 8 fours are 32, 8 fives are 40, 8 six are 48, 8 sevens are 56, 8 eights are 64, 8 nines are 72, 8 tens are 80. And that's what we have here. 8 to be divided equally into 8 shares. And what will be the answer? 10. There will be 10. If you put into 8 groups, in each group there will be 10. 8 divide equally into 8 groups. In one group there will be 
10. So, 8 divided, 80 divided by 8 is equal to 10. In reverse, division is reverse multiplication. 10 8s are 80. 8 10s are 80. Now, you learn to find the answer using multiplication. Good. Let's look at another sum. See what we have here. 36. We have 36 items to be grouped into 6. 36 divided by 6. We got to find the answer. So, we should know 6 times table. Good. 6 ones are 6. 6 twos are 12. 6 threes are 18. 6 fours are 24. 6 fives are 30. 6 sixes are 36. 6 sevens. 6 sevens are 36. We need only up to 36. 6 sixes are 36. We have 36 items to be grouped into 6 groups. And in each group we have how many? 6. 36 divided by 6. Answer 6. So you get the answer 6. In reverse multiplication, 6 6 is 36. 6 into 6, 36. You found the answer using the tables. Okay? 36 divided by 6 is equal to 6. Good. Let's look at another sum. We have here 36 to be, 36 items to be grouped into 4. 36 divided by 4 gives you the answer. Let's find using our tables, 4 times table, 4 ones are 4, 4 twos are 8, 4 threes are 12, 4 fours are 16, 4 fives are 20, 4 sixes are 24, 4 sevens are 28, 4 eights are 32, 4 nines are 36. And that's the number we want. 4 nines are 36. So we have to divide 36 in 4 groups. And our answer is 9. In each group, how many will be there? 9. 36 divided by 4 gives you 9. In reverse multiplication, you have 9 fours are 36. 4 nines are 36. So, we learn to find the answer using multiplication. Let's look at another sum. Look. 72 to be equally divided into 9 groups. Now, let's look at. Write down the 9 times table. 9 ones are 9. 9 twos are 18. 9 threes are 27. 9 fours are 36, 9 fives are 45, 9 sixes are 54, 9 sevens are 63, and 9 eights are 72. And that's the number we want 72. 72 divide equally into 9 groups, and we get answer 8. Reverse multiplication 8 nines are 72. 9 8s are 72. So, you learn to find the answer using multiplication. Let's look at another sum. We have here 90. 90 items to be grouped, divide equally into 10 groups. 90 to be grouped into group of 10. Group in equally divide into 10 groups. Let's see. We got to know the 10 times table here. Yes? Let's write down. 10 ones are 10. 10 twos are 20. 10 threes are 30. 10 fours are 40. 10 fives are 50. 10 sixes are 60. 10 sevens are 70. 10 eights are 80. 10 nines are 90. We have 90 items to be grouped into 10. And what's the answer you get? You get 9. 
you get 9 in each group. Reverse multiplication, 9 tens are 90, 10 nines are 90. Using table, 10 times table, we learn to find the answer. 90 divided by 10, you get 9.